Well, well, well. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Young H to the double AK. I am him in the flesh. And welcome to another edition of Let's Play Live. Right now, we're on Mortal Kombat X. Excuse me for my bed spread. Say no. Excuse me for my little little blanket in the back of the back, but don't worry about back of that. We on this thing right now, and I'm here to show you guys the fatalities for all the characters. The first uh, string of fatalities to all the characters right here on Mortal Kombat X. The game was just released for the Midnight Crowd. I was a part of the Mortal Kombat uh, Midnight Tournament over at GameStop Park West in West Philly. And not only did I get to pick up my limited edition GameStop exclusive Mortal Kombat X for PS4, my own limited edition with the entire season pass for the combat pack, as well as the collective Cold War Scorpion uh, skin with all new skins, guest characters, four playable classic combatants, and iconic guest characters in the scheme and the theme packs coming soon. But I won a free copy of the game, the standard edition, regular Mortal Kombat X. You know what I'm saying? Got the standard edition right there for those not in the know on PS4. I'll be putting up a uh, contest soon for people to be able to win a copy of Mortal Kombat, that free copy right there, seeing as how I won the tournament. Right now, we're going to walk through the fatalities of the game. I mean, I've seen several. I've done, I played with uh, Sub-Zero through the whole tournament, so when I was playing with Subs, you know, Guess what? The boy won the tournament with this saying, freeze your ribs and break you up. So some of these fatalities will be the first time I've seen them. It's like, no, I watched all the fatalities due to the developer videos that they put on YouTube. But if you didn't get the chance to see it, you get to see it right there. Here goes Kodo Khan's first fatality. And look at that, ladies and gentlemen. And that was gruesome. They took that Kano fatality to the next level right there. To rip your heart out, John, back in the day. All right, as I'm pouring some more water out of my Brita. Gotta drink that good, good water. Let's see, I guess we can go with Scorpion next. Make sure you guys click on the like on if you're watching this as a rebroadcast on YouTube. Click on that good, good like <clears throat> and subscribe button down there. If you got pages you want me to subscribe to and or like, make sure you guys go ahead and leave it in the comment section below. If you're watching live right now on Twitch.tv, hit that good, good heart button up. And if you already are a member of my page, email me and find out how you can get a free copy of Mortal Kombat X on the PS4. I won it in the tournament. I don't need two copies, so instead of just trading it back in, as I was told that I could just go ahead and get a brand new $60 game, so I could have got anything else, but I decided to go ahead and get that extra copy of Mortal Kombat X just to do a video game giveaway for my fans. Here we go with Scorpion, his is back down forward triangle. I'm talking! This looks awesome on my Vizio 4K TV, by the way. Indeed. See the tongue still moving a little bit? The attention to detail in this game was awesome. And for it to be a fighting game and they made it look this great, it's Mortal Kombat. It's the first one on next gen consoles. Available Tuesday, April 14th on Xbox One as well as at PS4. And as you can see, I'm playing the PS4 version. And there will be a PS3 and Xbox 360 version slated to come out in the beginning of June. But it may get canceled. Who knows? I hope not because this game is awesome. And if you can get it on the older gen consoles for those individuals who did not play the game at all or who did not go ahead and upgrade to a PS4 or an Xbox One yet, it is an awesome thing. Don't let them miss out on it. NetherRealm Studios and WB would be idiots to miss out on that money because there's still a plethora of individuals that love playing their PS4. I'm sorry, their PS3, their Xbox 360. So... Let's not miss out on those guys, shall we? Let's go with Katana. Let's 
Make sure you guys tune into Twitch.tv as well as Blog Talk Radio at 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, nighttime that is, for Radio AFG Live, the independent platform for independent artists and entrepreneurs. Got a topic you want to talk about? Got music or a business you want to promote? Send me an email to defydeucegun at gmail.com. That's D-A, the number five, D-U-E-C-E-G-U-N at gmail.com. And I'll get back to you in my earliest convenience and we can talk about promoting you and your businesses and it costs you absolutely nothing. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Here's Katana Service is down forward, back forward, and the triangle, which would be the high punch button. Nice. Oh, that was high. That was crazy. That was crazy, folks. Hers, I didn't see yet. That one, I didn't see that one from her. Go down the list here. Sub Zero is my favorite character, man, since the first Mortal Kombat. It's kind of like Street Fighter when, like, Ken and Ryu were first brought out. Like, Ken Masters is my guy. Sub Zero was my guy. What's that? Back forward, back back. Oh, right here. Back forward, back back. There you go. Damn, his is not even a fucking nice. His is not even a button press. His is just a motion. That was okay. Playing with the Kenshi that has that fucking face bat, that, that bandana not wrapped around his eyes, that version of him is crazy. That motherfucking combo is stupid with that version. By the way, for those of you not to know, unless you've been living under a rock for the past several months, I don't know why you don't know, but for those of you not to know, each character comes with three different variations, each coming with their own special abilities and moves, while still maintaining their core character abilities. Shout out to my homie Leon. Me and him were the last two combatants in the GameStop Mortal Kombat X tournament. Uh, for second place, he won a free MKX gamepad, like you know, the little Sega Genesis looking controller with the six buttons across. He won that joint for Xbox One because he has it on Xbox One. And because I was in first place, I get a free copy of the game. So that's awesome. <laughs> down, down, back, forward, block. Take that grenade. Arms off. Damn, he is off too. She used the gadget to get you out of there. Okay, Sonya, your first fatality is like the first one I'd be like, ah! like that car commercial. But it was like, so do you offer the same powertrain warranty as those guys over there for you? He said, ah! right. I don't know about hers. Shout out to Carl Weathers. About to get <laughs> a skin to be Jax. Right now, he kind of looks like... Uh, Terry Crews right here. <laughs> this version of Jax looks like Terry Crews a little bit. Sub Zero. Takeda. Did he say you see that? I know that's right. Let's go. I'm about to rip you all up to pieces, man. Let's go. Forward, back, down. Triangle. Push your arms inside your body. And use your head as an ashtray. Look at that, folks. Just look at that. And you ask why is games like Mortal Kombat rated M for Mature? Yeah, there you go. Hey, I'm just going down the list over here. My bad. I had to grab my jack o' lantern. Kung Lao. 
down back down Fort Circle. He tripped the shit out of that bitch. Oh man, if you guys are squeamish, please do not get this game. I did subs. Well, you guys didn't see it, so I'm going to do his again right now. Right. Laugh at her. <laughs> you. You guys are going to see that a lot. Back forward, down back. The fatality that won me the tournament. I'm not mad at him. I've seen his better spikes of fatality as well. I think I like that one better in terms of the one we just seen. Melina. Kunji. She want to go growling at motherfuckers. I'm just saying. You want to come around growling at niggas. I'm just Oh, and shout out to the homie Rich from Review Tech USA from always keeping it real and giving his personal opinions and real actual fact, not just, oh, it's me and follow my way. Shout out to the homie motherfucking Rich from Review Tech USA. He kills it. Down, back, down, back, X. I seen this one at the tournament. I got a Kung Lao Kebab or Kung Jin Kebab. I'm done. This game is awesome. And I just put it in. It's installed. I played story mode. I'm going to play the towers. I'm in the Lin Kuei faction. So if you guys are on joining faction, get into the Lin Kuei. I'm a Sub Zero guy. Actually, no. I've killed you already, Cassie. Purchase Goro. I already have him, but let's just find out. Right. There's no content for sale right now. I already put my code in for him. He's just not available yet. So available yet, I guess. For this to be a fighting game and as much detail they put into their backgrounds, their characters, the collision detection and things of that nature, I just gotta take my hats off. Finish. Down four, down back triangle. Whip it good. Oh. Oh. That's crazy. Now I didn't see that one. When they showed Takeda's uh, fatality on the L the Nether Realm uh, developers joint, it wasn't that fatality they chose to show from Takeda. Trusty Zippo. Had to do it three times. Got this diesel. Diesel OG or Sour OG is what they called it. This medicinal shit, y'all know nothing about that. Meanwhile, y'all be on the streets and shit by street weed. Bubblehead. Now I've seen this one at the developers conference. Right, watch your blood, man. Pick that hole. Right, now there's blood all over your face. And somebody's got popped in the back. 
Special Forces boy back there popping niggas. Fake ass hunk from Resident Evil 2 back there popping Baracas. <laughs> he back there popping Baracas. No, we ain't talking about no cold medicine for those not enough. I gotta learn how to play with her. Cause I seen some sick combos with her. And everybody know I'm with sick combos, ladies and gentlemen. See you at the crossroads. You damn right it's on. Here we go, let's see. Back four, back four triangle. I seen this one in the conference, yo. Right. Blow your insides out through your back. This game, dog. And I, as I said, I have the limited edition version of this, Joe. I know it comes in like a standard box, but you see it's different artwork on the front. It says limited edition. And this is the GameStop exclusive limited edition version. So I don't know if there's like a Best Buy limited edition version or a Walmart limited edition version, but I know I got the GameStop limited edition version and I have a brand new unopened standard version once again because <laughs> I won the tournament. So for those of you out there thought that I was bullshit when I told you that fighting games is my favorite genre, you better think again. Matter of fact, ladies and gentlemen, give me a second because I need to put up my motherfucking effects this diesel tastes crazy right now but gotta put up my effects give it up give it up for the Mortal Kombat X you gotta give it up for the X let's get out of here see the next one so we stop that Jackie Jackie say what you doing now what y'all know about Night Shift y'all know about that <laughs> it seems like yesterday. Now, I believe I'm also going to do a vid on the different character variations. So there will be a day where I'll just go into the practice mode and I'll choose different uh, variations of the character. Explain that they all have their same core abilities, but they each come with their own unique set of combos and abilities. So stay tuned for that video. Who did I kill last you? <laughs> Territory. What you up there screaming for? She, ah! See, there you crazy ass lady. Stop trying to pick the bones of motherfuckers. You want to just jump on niggas with claws and shit. You just want to come Wolverine motherfuckers up. Close your down. Don't like that. Close your down, baby. Close your down. All right. Tail four, tail back triangle. Oh, yeah. I see this one too. That was awesome. Was that awesome or what? We're gonna start at this end. Oh, you gotta complete the story mode to unlock Shinnok. Okay, that's cool. One unlockable character from playing through the game. Now I started off with his fatality. Y'all saw that. Let me let this go out for right now. Come back to you, Diesel, because that shit right there is crazy. A Diesel OG. Sour OG. Sour Diesel mixed with OG clutch. That thing is crazy. I don't want to be coughing all of it. Wham! Oh my goodness! My God! That man's got a family, kid! 
Nice. The fatality is real, folks. The fatality is real. Yeah. <laughs> Cage Johnny. Uh. Macker. Mm -mm. <gasps> mm -mm. Mm -mm. Johnny Cage. Scorpion. Liu Kang. Kano. Sonya. Sub Zero. Back four, back four box. I've seen this one as well. This is crazy. Here's Johnny. Doom, doom, doom. Johnny Cage wins. Fatality. Hashtag who's next? Aaron Black. See, I've never read the court, the comic book that he was featured in, but I gotta do my research on this guy because uh, Aaron Black seems to be a pretty cool character. It wouldn't be Mortal Kombat without Liu Kang in it in some way, shape, or form. Even though I'm not a Liu Kang, like I don't play with Liu Kang like that, I'm a Sub-Zero guy. It just wouldn't be Mortal Kombat if you didn't have Liu Kang represented in some way, shape, or form. And Netherrealm, WB, Boom, hey, Guys, go back to your original Xbox and PlayStation 2 and think about Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks. You know, the spiritual successor to games like Mortal Kombat Special Forces and Mortal Kombat Mythology Sub-Zero. Think about doing something like that in between the next Mortal Kombat game, whether it be a DLC for this one, which I doubt, or whether you make a standalone game that could be a digital download purchase as opposed to a whole physical CD box game. Why don't you make another game like that? Because Shaolin Monks was hot as shit. The ability to beat people ass and then do fatalities on them as an action adventure exploration game, it was hot. Put that as a secondary mode or make that a standalone game for like $14.99, $19.99 or something like that on the PSN and Xbox stores. That'd be a great fucking idea. You see, off screen, I have a, a modified original Xbox, like the first Xbox, the original Xbox One. <laughs> I have the original Xbox modified with over 7,500 games, with over 7,000 games on there, ranging from systems like Arcade, Amiga, Master System 32X, PlayStation, regular Xbox, uh, the X6800 Sharp, regular Nintendo, Super Nintendo, ColecoVision, Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, Game Boy, there's a bunch of shit on there from every system. Long story short, I got all the Mortal Kombat, so I get to go back and play the Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3s and things of that nature. And also, I get to play those old school games. So when I get to look at my when I get to look at my uh, my Mortal Kombat mythologies on that system, because I definitely have it. This is exclusively new. I haven't seen this yet. Oh shit! That was awesome. My man shoot a fucking sand bullet to you. And that motherfucker explode inside of you and just keep saying, like, I'm looking at Luke Kang, that's crazy. But as I was saying, man, on my Xbox with all the emulators and all that, I have uh, actual real copies of Mortal Kombat Mythologies and uh, Path of Neo. My Mortal Kombat Mythologies box is not close to me right now. Oh! It's not close to me right now. My bad, ladies and gentlemen. My, uh, what's the name? is not close to me right now. My Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks, but my Into the Matrix Path of Neo is right here. I have the original joint of this. I had just to take the plastic off and, you know what I mean, put the disc in and burn the disc onto my hard drive so I can keep this box and disc and everything in pristine shape. But I burned them on my hard drive and I've been playing Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks, put in the code to play with Sub-Zero Scorpion in the story mode from the rip, playing with Sub-Zero. Yo, just that action adventure element and then putting in brutalities and fatality tokens and all it's awesome what y'all did with that game and that was midway back then ed boone you're the creator of mortal kombat you're still working on it with another realm of your own company and with wb who funds you for this fucking game go out there and say damn let me do a form check to see if only it's not just hakeem crazy ass that wants to see mortal kombat shaolin monks come back just as a different game that formula worked that game was heralded hot i fuck with that john 
That game was crazy. Now imagine the technology we have for graphical prowess and things of that nature and the power of the Xbox One and the PlayStation 4. Make a game like Mortal Kombat, Shaolin Monks, starring anybody. You can pick anybody from the Mortal Kombat series. And now that you got the MKX out, take some of the characters that are lesser known. Make it the Shaolin Monks, the four new characters that's in here with Jackie, Cassie, Takeda, and fucking uh, Kung Jin, those being the four new Mortal Kombat guys to help the new era, the young guys that be the helping usher in the new era of Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat to help Earth Realm stay away and shit like that. You see how they age in Kung Lao, Jax, and everybody like that on the game. So take those four characters right here and just go ahead and make the next Mortal Kombat Mythologies game or Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks game, call it whatever you want, but make it in that Shaolin Monks formula and use those characters to tell a better backdrop story on them. I know we're gonna see a better a, a, a backstory on them probably in the story mode, but in case we do, or if we don't, go ahead and make an even more fleshed out character driven story based on those characters in the Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks realm. It'd be fucking awesome. I believe so anyway. All right, so we just got finished doing Aaron Black. We're gonna go with King Liu. <laughs> Everybody gets killed, everybody kills somebody. <sighs> I did an excellent job with this game. Like it's truly a next generation, the first next generation fighting game. It's not like a game that was already on the previous system and they digitally remastered it or just released it like in the term of Guilty Gear XR, hot game. But it was also on PS3. I had it because I never owned it on PS3, so I had the PS4 version. But this isn't a game that was on another system. They just brought it out on PS4 and just tweaked the graphics. This was made for PS4 and Xbox One. Good job, guys. Another person who just has motion. Damn. Ripped out this nigga Larynx and made him eat it. Take your windpipe. Pour this trachea out. That was crazy, folks. So that was one of Luke King's fatalities. I think I've seen this other one where he turns it. I'm not going to give it away. You guys go ahead and check it out. Grab Mortal Kombat X. By the time you're watching this video, if you're watching on my YouTube page, the game is out. It came out Tuesday, April 14th. It is now Monday. Well, it's not now Monday because it's past 12 o'clock. It's fucking 2.45 in the morning. So it's technically Tuesday, April 14th. But the game was able for reservists to be released at 12 a.m. at GameStops around the world. Uh, I was at the Park West GameStop and I got the free copy for the standard version and I paid for the $100 limited edition. Had that pre-ordered already. Got my Goro code and everything on my receipt somewhere around here. PS4 joint, you know I mean? Got my shit already rocking. So, we gonna do this thing up. Ermax next. A couple of his... So, brutalities aren't combos on here. They are moves or variations of moves that you already do that are on your move list that, in a way, are enhanced and will kill your opponent. You have to meet certain criteria and things of that nature in order to do it, but at the same time, it's awesome. And each character has about five or six different ways they can go at it. Check out video footage on brutalities. I'll post up one of them too once I learn how to do everybody's time down and everything like that. I'll make sure I make a video putting that up there. There you go. You can still do that. They had to hold the block button. Sheesh! Contortionist! Oh wow. Wow. Hey, don't get mad at me. I'm just a messenger. Ermac was the last one. Yeah. Ermac was the last guy. But, seeing as how the video started this way, I guess I'll end it. Oh, no. No, he's not. I still got to go away down to Quan Chi. What am I talking about? See, the fact that I already fucking did Kodo Khans, that's where I started that, made me think, oh, I did everybody's. No, I didn't. 
I did Kodo Kans, I didn't do reptiles and everybody else that that. So let's go ahead. Right. Let's go ahead and get this out of here. Sorry for this, my freaking behind my ear is itching. Like not even inside my ear, behind my ear is itching. Because of my freaking hair, man. The hair just goes everywhere. You feel it on the side, you thinking, ah, what is that? Dun, 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 dun. I have to watch some Mortal Kombat movies now. Hey, bad enough you already got your shit burnt up. Hey, then split your shit. Damn. Split a wig. Splitting wigs, no barbershop, ladies and gentlemen. That's a 52nd Street joke for those not to know. About to say, what the hell happened to my head? Camera made this shit look weird, like it wasn't nothing on that side. Like, what the fuck happened? All right, I've seen. Ugh, oh, I've seen some shit that motherfucker can do. Who didn't get shown dying yet? Yeah, he didn't. See you at the crossroad. So there's a bag of ice that I poured. So I had to grab some stuff out of ice out of and put in my cup. Left the bag of ice sitting right next to me. So we're melting, melting, melting as we speak. Forward back, forward back. Another one bites the dust, ladies and gentlemen. That fucking fatality is one of the gruesomest standalone, I'm not standalone, but first train fatalities they have in the game. In terms of how it shows, like, your whole fucking insides and everything like that, like, that's crazy. Man. That's one of the new characters, so. They did a good job. They didn't just throw somebody in there and give them some generic bullshit fatality. A character I'm very interested in learning how to play with. Once again, if you're right here on Twitch.tv, go ahead and click that good, good heart. Subscribe to the page. If you want me to subscribe to your page, just leave the information in the comment section. I'll do that. If you're watching this on my YouTube page or want to go to my YouTube page from Twitch, YouTube.com forward slash the number five, D-U-E-C-E-G-U-N. That's YouTube.com forward slash five deuce gun. You can get down. Subscribe to the YouTube page. I'm going to be giving out a free copy of Mortal Kombat X. You want a copy on PS4? Here we go. Brand spanking new, never open. I don't have to open this. I have the limited edition with the season pass and all that, but you know, you guys can go ahead and shout out to the idiots out there, by the way, who paid $150 for the Scorpion toy. My brother bought that shit too, no disrespect to my little brother, but I'm not buying that John unless I'm a collector or I planned on flipping it, but because it's only $50 extra than the limited edition version is, People really know that the toy only worth $50, so why would you pay more for it? I'm just saying. Back for bag X. Bugaboos. Got a quarter bottom scarab beetles, man. That's how, how she's standing there over top of you and shit, like just looking like that. This game is fucking crazy. I did the uh, the practice mode tutorial, unlocks a trophy when you complete the tutorial, just to get the basics of the game down. And that was just a few minutes ago. I didn't do any basic training or anything like that when I was at the GameStop tournament. They put that game on, I played with Sub-Zero, Cryomancer version, went through the whole motherfucking list of people, man. It was a good job.
pull back for it. Nice. That makes sense. Tongue in cheek and gruesome. Because it was kind of funny and it was crazy gruesome when you seen the head pop off and then get blown to smithereens. I put your brains on the table, I could read your thoughts. <laughs> Last but not least, exactly. Once again, if you guys got businesses, whether it's music or entrepreneurial, just to help with communities, you have some type of volunteer program that you do helping people out and you want to promote it and get the word out. If you just want to speak your mind and got something that you feel as though you need to bring to public attention, you can always be a person that I interview live on air or someone that can send the information through to the five deuce gun at gmail.com and I'll air it on my radio show, Radio ARG Live, Monday through Saturdays, 11 p.m. to 11.30 for the live feed and 11.30 to 11.45 for the extended podcast on Blog Talk Radio. But right on twitch.tv from 11.45 p.m. Eastern Standard Time until 12.45 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. We rocking out on Radio AMG Live and make sure you guys send your music in. It doesn't have to be radio edited because I play uh, uncensored music. It's an uncensored show. So send your music, your commercial sound effects, or anything that you want promoted to defydudesgun at gmail.com. Make sure you put in the subject header Radio AFG. That way I know that you're trying to get promotions, and I'll take care for you. $3.99 on the independent platform for independent artists and entrepreneurs. That's what we do, man. I don't mind looking out. I'm not well off by any means, but pass it forward, you know? Forward, back, forward, back, circle. Oh, shit, wrong person. There we go. Come to Butthead. There's the most, there's the second most gruesome in my opinion. His and Ferritor. Fair court, that John crazy. Crazed and amazed, ladies and gentlemen. Crazed and a fucking amazed. All right, that was everybody's fatality right here on Mortal Kombat X. I thank you for rocking out with me. Remember, hit that good, good heart button and subscribe right here on Twitch. Or if you're watching this as a rebroadcast on my YouTube page, go ahead and hit that good, good like and subscribe button. And if you have a page that you want me to follow back, make sure you leave it in the comment section below. It's your boy Young H to the double AK. I am him in the flesh. And I just finished him on Mortal Kombat X right here on Twitch.tv. Thanks for joining me on another episode of Let's Play Live. I'll see you guys next time.